Hello everyone, I'm Alaudas and I bring you here the demo of Fairy Tale Dungeons uh, for a PC. So the full game is supposed to come out on August 26, but they released a demo for people to try it out. Uh, so this game is developed by Genolab and published by Kodansha. Probably it's the ones that published the the manga of it of uh, Fairy Tale. I don't know, uh, but yeah, like uh, this a uh, whole light uh, game. Uh, with characters of fairy tale, as you can see over here. I don't know how many there is, and uh, you know there's cards, and you can put uh, like uh, abilities and stuff. Like it looks, it looks interesting. I played a little bit, and uh, it looked interesting. I'm gonna be honest. I thought it would be uh, shit, but uh, it is interesting. It is, it is interesting. Develop a Chino Lab. Chino Labu, not Lab, Labu, Chino Labu. Of course, it's like, a, you know, very indie uh, game. Uh, they have the permissions to use the, the Fairy Tale IP because it's called Asha Publishing. Turk's story adventures and countless battles, all known of the famous mage kill Fairy Tale. Yet all were surprised when the mysterious door was suddenly discovered hidden below their guild hall. Natsu Dragnil. Guild arts is gone. A P. Other guilds are reporting folks missing too. I'm sure guild arts can handle himself, but something is definitely weird. Like uh, this thing here. Screams trouble, doesn't it? What the heck? Something is flowing out of it. Now what? Oh, it's pulling us in. There was that cat. What's a Vulcan doing down here? Fire dragons. Ah, what's wrong? My magic eats. You again? Did you come to save us? Uh, we owe you one. Thanks. Uh, Cat got your tongue? I, uh, you, you wouldn't happen to be not so unhappy, would you? Yeah, but how do you know that? Do you know each other? Uh, uh this mysterious cat, Labby. Uh, um, well, my name is Labby. I was out searching for a friend of mine who finally see. I'm this mage who, with a prosthetic arm, who was passing by saving me from these monsters, right? Lead them off, all off away from me, yeah. But as he did, he told me to pay a fairy tale visit. Said to look for a guy with pink hair named Nat and a blue cat called Happy, you know? A mage with a prosthetic arm. Got to be a guild arts. Not so happy, please help me find my dear friend Arthur. You got it. That much you can definitely do. Oh, thank you, thank you. But hey, where are we exactly? It's a labyrinth built from uh, hair and molding magic. It strips intruders from off their power, see? Once this light goes out, all sorts of terrible things will close in on us. We have to get our powers back before then. Any idea how we do that? We will really be in, in for it. If any big baddish close in on us while we are magicless, not sure magic's all we are out of either. You might have even forgotten how to fight monsters to begin with, yeah? Wait, seriously, we are just city ducks then? Relax. Who the hell is that? Kana, what are you doing here? Kana Alberon, I don't know all the characters of Fairy Tale, I'm gonna be honest. Looking for killers, what else? What's this I hear ab about you both being magicless? Like you are not? My magic cards work just fine. How's that fair? I'll tell you how. See, not only can I use the cards I have, but I can make new ones too. Here, I made one that's good for basic comb. Should be enough to help you fight. You sure basic combat's good enough? I don't. That's scar. This? Pretty great, right? Got this from my father, Igniel. What about it, though? Ah. Incredible, this brings out the latest power to improve the knowledge, see? That will do the trick. Perfect. Obtain a new amulet, Igneal, Scarf, Natsu Exclusive, you add Fire Dragon Arrow Punch to card deck when entering the labyrinth, add Fire Dragon's Cloud to card deck when entering the labyrinth. Oh my god. That should help us fight. I'll capture all the magic I find around this place in cards while I search for kill darts. The rest of you should collect them as you go. You bet, thanks. Alright then, let's get moving, Labby. Uh, take these two, okay? And this will be a Tom of Remembrance, see? It's a magical item that will help restore your power inside this labyrinth. Perfect, thanks, Labby. Now, how does it work? Well, you see. 
play tutorial. I'll start by explaining how the labyrinth works. All sorts of monsters lurk around in here, attacking any and all outsiders. Each floor is also home to a demonic iron beast, essentially the follower boss, okay? They won't attack while the lantern is lit, see? But it won't stay lit forever. The counter goes down one by one air with every move we make. Once it hits zero, the boss will move in on us. We need to have our powers back by then. So we get Nat's power back before the counter hits zero. And then we show that demonic warden beast who's really boss. Last time I collected this room to move, okay? We should be able to get the lacrima in here. By the way, we ca you can't go back to the space you came from or you'll bump into the boss. Never look back, that's my motto. The labyrinth is made up of lots of different types of rooms. So you can see, rising spot, like, the treasure, event, enemy, elite, and trader. Fancy that. Alright, you got yourself a Lacrima. Lacrima are mystical or rich in magical power, see? You see Lacrima and Tom's Rock members will grant you skills. They are using that Lacrima to obtain a new skill. First open, the, open up the Tom of members. Magic cards are on the left, skills on the right. Let's try unlocking this skill here, okay? That's it, you now have a brand new skill. Whoa, I feel strong already. Skills will help you through your monster barriers. Go ahead and close the Tomo members and let's move on. There's a monster in the room ahead. Think you can beat it with your new powers? Yeah, time to try your hand at battle. Go get them, Natsu. Let me start by explaining this screen. This is your HP. And this is where you are MP. MP will feel completely after each turn. At the start, you will be dealt 4 random cards from your tome. Now to use a card, you'll need MP, see? And different cards come with different costs. Just pick the cards I tell you to start with. Execute. Ba ba Let's take a look at what monster's doing. You can open up the details window to find out more about monster's behavior. This one looks like it's preparing to attack, see? It, it, if left to it, you'll lose as much HP as the number in red here. Yeah, 10. Let's do some defensive cards to block its attack. Your skills just activated and made you temporarily stronger. The details window shows info on both monsters and yourself. Let's keep on the offensive. Coming right up. Let's take a look at magic cards next, yeah? Hold down on the card to read its description. This one is a good bet to pick first. Magic cards get used in the art, you select them. Let's pick them first. This card, the first card you pick, alter the damage, the rest you will deal. That, uh, that monster is really losing health now. Let's finish it up by unleashing a magic uh, chain. You can activate the magic chain by selecting cards in a specific order. Cards will shine when there is a chance of unleashing a magic chain. Time to let them have it. Ooh. There we go. That was uh, a pretty cool animation. Nice word, now that's more like. When you defeat mods, you'll earn like in my and items. Now, so let's use one of the items you got. Some items you can use at any time, others only in battle. Let's move on to the next room. It's full of magic cards, you can only pick one item from a treasure share, be sure to choose carefully. Hmm. Magic cards come in three different types. Okay. You can check which cards you have in your tome. Crack it open whenever you want to see uh, what your cards can do. can see like this. Our lads almost out, get ready for the demonic wire beast. Here he comes, you ready, right? Ah. 
Head Wolf. There it is, I'm fired up now. That's the money grind beast of this floor. You got these nuts. Let's try changing targets. We should take this monster out first. It's getting ready to unleash a powerful special move. Time to look at how you can stop. You can do that from the details. Looks like you can cancel this attack by unleashing a magic chain. If you only had a fire dragon claw card in your hand. But we don't. Now what? Don't panic. We can, what we can do now is sacrifice some HP to redraw our hand. We will still redraw this card out, but it's the side like card and reveals your hand with new cards. We want to keep Fire Dragon, Iron Fist, so select that and hold on to the Draw Car button. Easy enough. Today's our lucky day. You drew Fire Dragon's Claw. Draw can be hand, but you can only do it once per turn. Losing it too much can leave you low health too, so be careful. Now that we have the cards we need, let's unleash a Magic Chain. That stop its special attack. Stopping a special attack leaves an enemy temporarily weakened too. I'll let you handle the rest of the battle yourself. Okay. We get motivation and do big damage. Preparing to interfere or take support actions. There we go. That do the trick. Another one of those doors. Pitting a demonic grind beast will fill the land. Let's head through the door and explore further in. I'm starting to feel strong again. I think I'm starting to get the hang of these players. Let's keep up the pace. Look out! Jesus Christ, what the hell was that? <laughs> Yowch! When you are fit in here, you lose all the powers you can see. Every time you enter the labyrinth, you'll be starting from zero all over again. Dang it, that's the last time I'm going down top. Oh, and before I forget, the labyrinth is constantly shifting shape, so you need to stay alert. If you ever forget how to go about things, make sure to check the help screen. You know, complete tutorial, in this time you can play through the first floor of the full game. Try making your way through the first floor in whatever playstyle you prefer. That's an elite. That's an event. Six. You need a lot. Let's see the event. Oh boy, could it be? Found fish. Have you ever seen anything so scrumptious? Obtain item golden dungeon car. Aha, got it. Recover 25% HP. Nice. See if I can uh, mage. Can you even get to there? Oh, you can. Okay. I probably could have killed it. Yeah, I could have killed it. That was uh, my bad. Oh, he goes and attacks to the other one. Okay, that's good. Hmm. 
Can try to do this one. Once you collect over a certain number of magic cards, you'll earn a bonus which can increase character stats. Really? Do I want to kill this one? Oh, I'm probably gonna over that to get to like this. There we go. Can't forget that I have that fish to heal. Can I get something? I can fight around your rower, mask chain. Can do that one. Again, the fish. Ah, oh, failure. Block that that much. Mm. Nice. This art is going to hold much longer, okay? Here he comes. You ready, right? Oh, he chose over here. Okay. Okay. Oh, she giant toad. What the fuck? Preparing for a special attack, stun has no effect. Deal 30 or more damage. I don't think this will be enough. Or does it do because of this? There we go. It passes. It. It's gonna do is that. Uh, nothing came out. Poison. 
We end it here. Easy. That do the trick. Another one of those ours. Let's fill the lantern with Edo Nana. Move on, yeah? I'm sorry, it feels strong again. Eighty-eight points, and that's the the end of the of the them. Like, uh, it, it's cool the game, you know. If you like these type of games, you know, hog light games, you know. Uh, of course, in here you can play. You can only play with Natsu. You cannot play with other characters. Uh, but this is only to give you a glimpse of the game. I don't think when the game, the full game comes out, it will be that big, you know, because that's. Be honest, is like uh, you know Kodansha trying to enter into the uh, gaming industry, so they they are trying to you know giving their IPs to these indie companies to make games with it, and uh, you know trying to uh, make it uh, into the PC gaming. For now, I don't know if it will ever come to uh, uh, consoles, but uh, yeah, like. It's a nice, uh, a nice little game in here. Like, uh, let's be honest, it's nothing. Oh shit! But uh, if you like hoglite games with cards, you know where you can learn new, uh, new stuff. Like, it's, it's uh, a nice one. There's even events, you know, for you to see. I, I don't know if it's always fish. You know, found the giant Glacima. Oh. You need to press one bar. Okay, that's interesting. Can I? You can always learn magic chain. Sanctify during road, then fire will increase dragon fang. Of course, all the characters will have different abilities and stuff like that. Battles are carried out by pressing magic or computer keys. Okay. Basically, say that you can press A W D S. Yeah, but it's like I uh, think of it like a slate slate spire, but with a uh, fairy tale, basically. It's what it is. Get that block. What if I do all this? It's cool is that if he kills one, he goes to another one. I think that's a, a good thing. Give the tag man free attack. Saying that you level up, with that does you obtain certain amount of cards. Massive lacrima, holy shit. Ah, failure. Oh, they 
events. You encounter got another Labyrinth Expedition. Mirajan, okay. Did you get swept up in this place too? Well, I mean, I was poking around a weird uh, door under the guild the next, well, here I am. Oh, I know, I'll try using this. Select one reward. I'm gonna get this. A lot of cards that does shoes, which is always uh, a bad thing. Oh. Can I learn another one? I can. Plus one to fight around credit blitz. I have zero. Yeah, I have zero of these cards. Provoke Offensive, I think that's the one that I need for that, but what the hell is this? See what the hell this card is Alright, here comes the enemy. Is it the same monster? Yeah Because you cannot remove, right? You cannot like uh, go back, no Oh, it's a different one. Goblin Bombardier Oh, okay that's a different type of boss, brings a lot of enemies. Ah, oh, didn't kill. Deal 5 are more damage over one turn. Tomorrow in Guaran Peace and all certain crash rules, special attacks. Only for one turn. I'm gonna host all of them. This guy because he's the one that's going to be big damage. Oops, the anti select, fuck. No, he kills himself after doing that. You get this thing, also you get hunk. Because you can always, you know, try, try, try also to obtain those things. But yeah, so if you want to try out the demo, you can download it's available the demo. And if you like it, you can wish list like that you get notified once the game comes out that's supposed to be uh, August 26 so it's already uh, next week that will come out they basically only listed them for you know people to see and play and uh, to see if they like it or not but yeah but think of it like 
Slate Spire, right? A little bit of Slate Spire with Fairy Fairy Tale IP in the mix. So yeah, so hope you enjoy here the demo of Fairy Tale Illusions, and see you guys next time. Bye.